Song lists can be used for all types of specialty programming. Typical application of the feature would be to set up something like a Top 500 Countdown or A to Z Weekend. Select Dataset, Library, Song List Editor. Give the list a name. To populate the list, use the Library Search Results section of the editor. You can use whole categories if you'd like, or use the Library Search to look for specific songs. For instance, if you were doing an all-female weekend, you could search the library for songs with a gender code of F and import that list. We're doing an A to Z by title weekend, so we'll add each of the categories we want to include. The Song List Editor allows you to add up to three additional fields for display. We'll add title to the list so we can sort that list. Click on Title, and the list is now sorted into the order we want. Save that list, and you are done. Depending upon the feature, there are other icons on the Song List Editor that you might use, including setting the pointer and shuffling the category. The pointer is designated by the blue line. When the list is scheduled, this is the first song that will be scheduled. The shuffle icon gives you numerous choices to mix up the category contents. Use your imagination, and you can come up with all sorts of specials to make your station stand out.